What's with all these boxes? Now that I'm house-sitting ISIS, Oliver thought it would make a perfect bunker to store all of his troops' equipment. You know, having a gang of superheroes is great in theory, but no one ever considers the shipping costs. Were you able to get the Veritas keys away from Lex? I spent all night with Lana. Clerk, I know you want to be with her, but whatever Lex opens with those keys will give him the power to control you. The only thing important right now is Lana. Right, but if Lex knows that you're the Traveler, game over. There's no saving Lana, there's no saving the day. Hello, Apocalypse. I don't care about Lex. Clerk, Lana's still alive. We're not giving up on her. Then why haven't we found Brainiac? You think that breaking national security laws is my idea of a good time? I'm sorry, Chloe. I know you care about Lana just as much as I do. We're just running out of ground to cover. Maybe we need to look to the sky. What about a satellite? Like NASA caliber? Carrie and Brainiac, when they left the Daily Planet, there might be a satellite that picked up their trail. It is possible that the velocity of their flight created some sort of ionic displacement in the outer atmosphere. But hacking into government satellites is light years out of my league. You can do it. Maybe it's time for me to step up to the majors. Thanks, Chloe. I wouldn't ask if it wasn't our last vote. Okay, well, I'm trying to access outer space with an Intel processor. I think maybe you could contend with the cosmos using the old-fashioned ways. Dr. Swan intercepted all of Jarrell's transmissions from Krypton. Now, it's possible he sent something about Brainiac. I think it's time to sweep the dust off of Dr. Swan's journal.